How to become left-handed when you are right-handed. Left-handers can also become right-handed by reversing the steps in this article. For some left-handed people, becoming right-handed has the additional advantage of avoiding the many inconveniences of being left-handed in a world designed for right-handers. Writing practice. Practice using your left hand daily. Becoming proficient with your left hand will not happen overnight. It's a process that could take months or even years to complete. So if you want to learn how to use your left hand, you will need to commit to practicing daily. Set some time aside each day to practice your left hand writing. It doesn't need to be much. Even 15 minutes a day will help you to improve at a satisfying pace. In fact, it is better not to commit yourself to practicing for long periods of time, as you will probably get frustrated and be inclined to give up. Practicing a little every day is the best way forward. Practice drawing letters in the air. Start by doing this exercise with your right hand, and then transfer it to your left hand by copying. Transfer the skill to paper later. Sustained practice will be required to properly prepare your muscles. Position your hand correctly. When training yourself to write with your left hand, it's important that you hold the pen or pencil comfortably. Many people are inclined to grip the pen too tightly, balling their hand up into a claw around it. However, this creates tension in the hand, causing it to cramp up and become tired easily. When this happens, you will not be able to write well. Keep the hand loose and relaxed instead, mirroring how you hold the pen with your right hand. Make a conscious effort to relax your hand every few minutes while you are writing. The materials you write with can also make a significant difference to how comfortable you find writing with your left hand. Use nice quality, lined writing paper and a good pen with free-flowing ink. Also tilt the paper or writing pad you are working with 30 to 45 degrees to the right. Writing at this angle should feel more natural. Practice your ABCs. Begin by writing out your ABCs with your left hand, in both capital and lowercase letters. Go slowly and carefully, concentrating on making each letter as well-formed as possible. Accuracy is more important than speed for now. As a point of comparison, you should also write out your ABCs using your right hand. From then on, you can focus on getting the letters you write with your left hand as perfect as those you write with your right. Hold on to your practice pages by keeping them in a folder somewhere. Then when you reach a point where you feel frustrated and tempted to give up on your quest to become left-handed, you can look back on these sheets and see how far you have progressed already. This should give you renewed motivation to continue. Practice writing sentences. When you become tired with the ABCs, you can progress on to writing sentences. Start with something simple like, I am writing this sentence with my left hand. Remember to go slowly and focus on neatness rather than efficiency. Then try writing, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog, over and over again. Since this sentence contains every letter of the alphabet, it's a good one to practice with other sentences containing all 26 letters are, the five boxing wizards jumped quickly, and pack my box with five dozen liquor jugs. Use writing workbooks. When children are learning to write for the first time they use writing workbooks where they can trace over letters made from dotted lines. This helps them to control their hand movement and gain accuracy. When learning to write with your left hand, you are essentially teaching both your hand and your brain how to write all over again, so using these workbooks is not a bad idea. You can also use copies with extra lines on the paper to ensure your letters are in the correct proportions. Try writing backwards. In the English language, along with many other languages across the world, people write from left to right or from thumb to pinky. This feels natural for right-handed people. It also helps to prevent the ink from becoming smudged as your hand moves across the page. For left-handed people, however, this movement often feels unnatural and can make a mess as the hand moves across the fresh ink. For these reasons, left-handed people often feel more comfortable writing backwards. In fact, the famous artist Leonardo da Vinci was left-handed and often wrote notes and letters backwards. They could only be deciphered by holding the paper up to a mirror and reading from the reflection. Practice your own backwards writing with your left hand. You might be surprised at how easy you find it. Remember to write from right to left, thumb to pinky, on your left hand. You will also need to write the letters backwards for true backwards writing. Do some drawing. Although the goal is to learn how to write with your left hand, you can also benefit from drawing with your left hand. This will give you valuable practice in controlling your left hand, while also building strength. Start with something simple, such as drawing basic shapes like circles, squares and triangles. Then progress onto sketching items you see around you, like trees, lamps and chairs. Then if you're feeling particularly confident, people and animals, drawing upside down known as inverted drawing using your left hand is another great exercise you can try. This will not only improve your writing skills, it is also a great brain training exercise which will open you up to more creative thinking. Many great artists such as Michelangelo, Da Vinci and Sir Edwin Henry Lancier were ambidextrous. 
This enabled them to switch from one hand to the other while drawing or painting if their hands got tired or they needed to work at a particular angle. Lancier was also famous for being to draw with both hands simultaneously. Have patience. As mentioned above, learning how to write with your left hand is a process that will take time and dedication. You will need to be patient with yourself and prevent yourself from giving up too easily. Remember that it took you years to master writing with your right hand as a child and even though it should nt take you quite this long to write with your left as some of the skills are transferable the learning process will take time. Don't worry about speed initially. Just keep practicing with as much control and accuracy as you can and you will become faster and more confident with time. Keep reminding yourself of what an impressive and useful skill it will be when you can write with your left hand. Staying motivated is the biggest challenge you'll face as you work towards becoming left-handed.